Augusta is preparing to say goodbye to the boathouse. Commissioners voting to begin the process of demolition instead of spending money to get rid of mold in the building. WJBF News Channel 6's George Escala reports. Augusta facing some big dollar decisions at the boathouse. I mean, you look at the handicap accessibility, um, just the ongoing maintenance issues with that building. So, um, you know, I, I have a little bit of heartburn right now spending that money to repair a building that we potentially could be looking at replacing. The boathouse is full of mold after a water main break. It forced the rowing club out of the building. The recommendation was to use up to $500,000 to remediate the mold, but some commissioners saying that doesn't make sense for a building in such poor shape. You're talking about spending anywhere from five to seven million dollars, or you're talking half a million or so remediation. Either way, it's a lot of money. In my opinion, you don't remediate a building that really needs to come down. Commissioners agreeing voting to go out for bids on the cost to tear down the boathouse, rejecting the option of spending nearly $6 million on renovation and remediation. No, sir, absolutely not. Uh, no, well, you, for that much, we could tear it down and, and do something different. But by not fixing the mold problem, the city will need to sit back down with a rowing club to determine what the club will need in the short term to stay operational. We have to put the onus back on them to let us know what their needs are at that particular time. And once we have that discussion, we can bring that back before this body. It's been a problem that has been festering, but now the city has set a new course at the boathouse. In Augusta, George Escala, WJBF News Channel 6.